everyone. It's that time again, sense of self time. Today, we're gonna be snooping through Louise's, AKA sprinkle of glitter stuff, haha. <laughs> I'm really excited for you all to see this because this was shot a little while ago when Louise was in LA and I thought it would be cool to show you what Louise brings with her when she travels to make her hotel room feel more like home. Because when you travel, especially if you're traveling a lot or for a longer period of time, you can get kind of homesick not being around the things that you're familiar with, especially if you're someone that finds comfort in routines. I totally feel that. Like even bringing a little travel candle with me sometimes, even if I don't light it, just having like the scent kind of being around makes a hotel room feel so much homier. Every time I see Louise, I get this immediate feeling of like home. I can't really think of another way to describe it. She just has this really welcoming presence and envelops you in it. And it's just so lovely and wonderful. And I actually just saw Louise not that long ago when we were in New York and it was like we said hi and then immediately just dove into a conversation like we had been hanging out for the last two weeks. She's just awesome. She's a woman that is very opinionated and speaks out and I admire her for that. And she's also really funny too and I love spending time with her I love seeing her and I'm really happy that she let me into her hotel room to let me snoop around so I hope you guys enjoy this as much as I loved seeing all of Louise's stuff so here we go Oh, hi. Oh, hello. Well, look at my home that I don't live in. It's nice to see you. away from home. Come on in. hotel room. We'll pretend I live here in this very glamorous hotel room. In actual fact, I do not. So, for smell, I chose... Oh, okay. Wait. <laughs> I just like touching my oh, nose I thought for it was smell. Like a, feature. <laughs> a few days ago, I was talking to someone on Facebook and they said they were laughing out loud. I was like, are you actually laughing? They said, no, I'm just doing short nasal blows. Like when you're like... <laughs> <laughs> and it really tickled me, short nasal blows. I'm gonna so add that to SMB. my vernacular. Yeah, instead of saying lol, I'm gonna be like SMB. <laughs> short nasal blows. SMB. Oh my god. Well, are we going to SMB yes. with this? What is this? So. This is my perfume of choice. It's nearly run out. It's the Juicy Couture one. It's not Viva La Juicy, it's the other one. They're all really sweet and floral. And what I particularly like is that you can take the lid off and it's tiny for your handbag. Oh. As much as I like like the Marc Jacob one with the big flowers and like all the stuff with the dangly bits, like it's got a fit in yeah. a bag. You can't carry that around you with can't. you. can't, and I'm not a display your perfume gal because you shouldn't keep them in sunlight. Yeah, that's what I've heard. Yeah, what does it do? Smell. Does it make them smell weird? I think like the sun rays affect the formula of the fragrance. Is that why people start to smell like, like old pee. lady perfume? Yes, most all they don't. Oh. Either their perfume is in the sun or they just don't Top pay. tip, <laughs> perfumes in drawers and wash, I'd say daily, <laughs> twice daily if you can. But Meaning wash your body, not yeah. your perfume. No, not yet, yeah, just do the essentials if you need to, yeah. except special occasions, <laughs> in which case I just stew in my own filth. Touch. Touch, here we are. Oh, how touching. <laughs> you touched my heart. What is this little bundle we have here? This is my little lovey, my snuggly. Oh my god. Yeah, I am a grown woman and I've had this a very long time. This is actually my third snuggly. They last about a decade. Oh so my, my first god. one, she was called Frilly Cover and she was pink and had rabbits on. Oh my god. I don't have her anymore. And then I got Pilly and he died because I loved him so hard. So this is Pilly the second. Pilly the second. <laughs> But what he actually is, is an old pillowcase. But all the seams have gone. There's a pillowcase inside him, but it's the outside one that I like. This is oh, so gross. This is amazing. This is, and I, I like to fold him over like this so you can get a good crease. And then with my hands, I do that. And then I like bunch them all up like flat. Gotta keep that bit there. And then I put my thumb on and just rub him here. Oh, I'm so soothed. The only thing is it's kind of awkward because if people don't know you and then you're like, oh, excuse me, I'm just gonna- Cuddle with just Pilly. Just gonna put this here, don't look. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would be like, look at Pilly the second. <laughs> 
here he is. Or she. It's a he, it's a okay. he. He's actually in love with me. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, but I don't feel what the same way about story. him. I know, it's very sad for him, but he's just happy for me to like rub him. But I'm actually training us probably the third now because this one is falling apart. Oh my gosh. So I have I a backup that I'm starting to love at home. Oh my it's goodness. Pilly the second, better watch out. Well, he'll just retire with Pilly the first, so he'll just go to like Pilly heaven. In loving memory of all of our blankets and snugglies. What do you have for our ears, dear? Oh, I see what you did there. Uh, two things. One, uh, I wanted to do the sound of makeup. However, the particular thing I wanted isn't in here. I wanted to get a metal uh, a glass jar, and then with a lid, and then when you put it on, it makes that like sound. Oh yeah. I have like a tiny one, but it didn't do the same one. But I like like. Ah, it's such a satisfying Dude. little just sounds good, doesn't yeah. it? it? sounds good. But something that I fiddle with a lot is my watch. It's a Michael Kors rose gold watch that everybody bought last year. Love it, love yeah. it. I love the tortoise. Yes, me too, because no one got that. Everyone just went for like the classic like yeah. rose gold one. But I fiddle with it a lot, so this is a sound I make all the time. You like the so, clicks. Yeah, like on panels, or if I'm talking to people, or if I'm in a meeting, I'll always be like doing that, which is really annoying. Or I do this with it a lot. I don't think that's annoying at all make that little noise. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, it just feels good. Fun story, my daughter, who's four, was playing with this the other day, and you see all the little knobs on the side. Mm -hmm. She said, Mummy, what are those for? And I said, oh, they're so I can change time. And she went, oh, can you make it Christmas? <laughs> I was like, oh, oh, you don't understand what I mean. And it's like, I can't quite change time that much. Oh my gosh, but, that's so sweet. Yeah. That's so cute. I love that. I wish I yeah. could go back to my childhood brain sometimes. Although sometimes I feel like I haven't quite left childhood brain. I mean, I just showed you my snuggly that I wrote for the so I'm with you on that one. I'm with you. Half oh. the joy of having a child is to do the kid things. Like, oh, I'll help you. Yeah. I'm going to help you with that ice cream. It's dripping. Uh, <laughs> oh, do you need a mermaid party? Anyone? Do you need a mermaid party? Oh my gosh, here we go. Here we go. This is happening. I think with our new looks, it's the perfect time for... Two things, English chocolate. This one I bought at the airport, I bought about 50. Oh, dairy milk! I'm gonna let you try this. Oh. And this one, my friend bought me to make me feel more at home. These are hobnobs, chocolate. Oh, oh, those are my favorite! There's one left, it's for you, it's for you. It's a chocolate hob. <gasps> there you go. Oh my gosh. It's oaty, it's chocolatey, it's the kind of chocolate that you have when you're a child. These are so good. And they're actually calorie free. They're not, they're not, but you don't oh, need to worry okay. about them. What? This one's great as well, this is new. Mm. This is biscuit and chocolate. So whenever I go away to America, I always have a day where I have like a wobble where I'm like, I wanna go home, I'm so afraid. So I just bring tons of chocolate for those days. Look at it. Oh my god. Look how pleasing it is. I've never had these. Oh. I've heard of dairy milk though. Welcome to joy. Hey look, have one of these squares. I'm already here. Yeah, just, there you go. This is the best taste we've ever done. You have the best taste. You really do. You know what time it is? It's time to go under the sea. Get it? This is my daughter. Oh, she's so cute. Oh my yes. god. I'll show you guys. Uh, this is one morning when she came into our room and said she styled herself. So she has like toy makeup that someone got for Christmas. So she's done her lipstick, as oh you can my see. Gosh. Uh, done a little bow on her head. I don't know what she's done to her hair. I think she just wet it in the bathroom. She does that a lot. That's how she styles hair. It's just like wets her hair. She's like, now it's wet. Yeah, she's like, now I am styled. <laughs> I love that. So I was like, all right, that's what you've done. Let me get you some more. I do have to say that pictures of Darcy on your Instagram are some of my faves. Oh, thank I you. Love them. This is when she was ready to go on holidays. No! <laughs> Look at it for God's sake. Oh she was my. like, I am ready for the airport. Oh my I gosh. am good and ready. You yeah. have a beautiful child. Thank you so what much. What a beautiful human. I, you made a human! Oh, I did. It was great fun to make <laughs> and then fine to grow and then to exit it. No fun at all. Yeah. So when I'm away and I'm like a bit like, Meh, just look through my little pictures of her and cheer myself up with that. Let me find one more. I'm being that mum that's like, look at my kid. Oh my god, I love just it. look at my kid. Ready for hair envy. Oh god. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Look at her. And she knows it too. Yeah, she's like, mum. She tells me, she's like, mummy, take a picture. 
Oh, to get a picture. And I'm like, all right. Well, she takes pictures herself. Oh my um, gosh. Basically, she is the greatest. So that's gonna be it for today. Thank you so much, Louise, for letting us Thank into you your hotel room. For letting us into your home. <laughs> <laughs> so make sure you go and subscribe to Louise if you're not already Thanks. subscribed. She is amazing and I love her. And um, now I always get shy when I say things about people. Now I'm gonna, <laughs> we're gonna ruin her face. We're gonna do a oh, yeah. challenge on my channel where I'm gonna just ruin your face. Oh yes. In the best possible way. With a retro challenge. Yeah, retro. Retro YouTube. Isn't that mad that now we can call YouTube something's retro? I know. Resurrecting the blindfolded man. Makeup challenge. Here In three we... minutes, I'm gonna have it timed as well. Oh my god! Okay. Pressure, the pressure's on. We'll see you guys with very different faces. <laughs> Bye! Bye! Do you want a party? Oh, I want a party. I want a party when I poop. This is what I want That's when I poop. I like, like to add an element of excitement to yep. the poop. And then I think maybe this is the pee lighting? Yeah, that's pee lighting. I'm hungover. <laughs>